Hello, I'm Brett Settles, and in this Revisto training session, we're going to be creating a 3D overlay. When creating a 3D overlay, we will start from 2D. In 2D, up at the top right, you'll see a Setup 3D Overlay button. When selecting that, we'll then be able to select the area that we want to overlay onto the 3D model. Once we're finished, we're going to select Done in the top right corner. And that's going to allow us to cut our section at which this drawing will be placed. Here I'm going to use the top of this structure. And I'm going to cut the section down to about halfway through the actual infrastructure. When selecting Done, that will now allow me to rubber sheet my overlay into place. Using control click, I can drag the, the grip points to critical locations that will allow me to align this drawing much easier. By using just left click, I can then pull them into place. I can then zoom in to gain more control, control click once again to place that directly on that line and get that aligned up just perfectly. I'll do the same down here. And when satisfied with the 2D alignment of the drawing, we select Done. And the final question is, how deep do you want issues to react to this sheet? Or essentially, for Revit users, what is the view range? We're going to go above the pavement on top and below the structures on bottom to make sure any issue that we find with that structure is going to be recorded on that sheet. You will now see the viewpoint that can be activated with the overlay. And you will also see all of the issues are now interactive with the 3D and the 2D space.